Hello, welcome to an e-demo on how to use the image editor feature in Victor Unified Client. The image editor is part of the incident management feature of Victor, so it allows you to manipulate images to highlight what is required for a particular incident. I already have an incident created, and I already have an image which has been added to it. So I'm just going to open up my incident list so we can take a look at that. I'll just choose Home, Incident Management, and Show All. And you can see there's my incident, and there's my image. What I want to do is open up this image and make some edits to it. So I can just right click on it and choose open image. It's going to open up the image in the image editor and you can see along the top we have a toolbar which allows us to make certain edits to the image. First couple of buttons are save and close and save so of course we would use those once we have finished our edits. Next buttons along are undo and redo and then we have a cursor selection tool and we have the zoom to fit the window button. Moving along we have a crop tool so I can just choose it and draw around what I want to crop and it's going to automatically crop that for me. Next along we have a button to add some text so I can choose it then I can choose a font from the drop down and I can choose a size from the drop down also and I can also use the color picker to set the color of that text. Once I've done all of that I can just select somewhere in the drawing and if I enter the text I want to place on there I can just choose OK and you can see that text has been placed on to the image. Moving along then we have some basic drawing tools. So we have a tool to draw an ellipse, a rectangle and a line. And we can use this drop down to set the line style and we can use the slider to set the line width and of course the color picker will also set the color of those shapes. What we can do is just choose one and just draw directly onto the image like so. Once I have all my edits done what I'm going to do is just choose save and close button. That's going to save those edits to that incident. So if I right click on the file again, just choose open you can see those edits are there. What I can also do though is I can right click on the file and I can choose open original image and that's going to open up the original unedited image and from that right click menu on the image I can also revert back to my original image at any time. 